the best way to truly unleash the power of your Humminbird Fish Finder and Minn Kota trolling motor is to allow them to work together, communicating seamlessly through the One Boat Network. Building a fully integrated fishing network on your boat is easy and requires just a few simple components. First, let's consider a basic two-component network, where one Humminbird Fish Finder is networked to another. You'll need a Humminbird Ethernet cable to serve as the backbone of the network. Ethernet cables are available in a variety of lengths to suit any installation. If you are linking two Solix units, that Ethernet cable is all that you'll need, as it screws directly into the back of your Solix. However, if you are networking Helix units, then each Helix needs its own Ethernet adapter which allows the Ethernet cable to connect to the Helix. Now, let's consider another simple network, one where an Ethernet accessory, like an iPilot link system or a 360 imaging device, is networked to a single fish finder. In this case, very few extra parts are needed, as both iPilot link and 360 imaging each come with their own Ethernet cables. Just add an Ethernet adapter if you're connecting to a Helix. Now, a more comprehensive one-boat network frequently has more components. For example, on my boat, I have two Solix units, one Helix unit, an iPilot link system, and a 360 imaging device. That's five network components. Anytime more than two components are to be networked, you'll need a five-port Ethernet switch. The Ethernet switch serves as the control hub for your network. Ethernet cables from each component are run to the five-port switch, which allows each networked component to talk to all the others. Humminbird's one-boat network is easy to build and easy to expand, and will help you to find and catch more fish on every trip.